first two vintages, they actually the wines were made, it was Cabernet, they were made down at State Lake Winery. Okay. And then in, by 82, they completed this part of the winery okay. building. And over the years, it's sort of added more tank. This will be my 13th vintage this year. So Kurt calls me, it's like three o'clock in the morning. He's like, look, kid, you need to come back. You know, we've got a winemaker job for you. Just come back. So, okay, I'll be there in a month. Hung up the phone. My wife goes, oh, so did you take the job? I said, yeah. She goes, what did I pay? I'm like, I don't know. You didn't, I didn't ask. They just said, come back. We have good relationships with our Coopers. I mean, we try all different Cooperages every year. Um, they have all these different seasoning yards and each seasoning yard, it'll season a different way and so the seasoning gives you a slightly different flavor. But so like this barrel will give you lots of bright front fruit on the palate. This barrel gives you lots of spice and texture. And this barrel gives you a creamy mint palate and sweet. So it's understanding which barrel works in which way and how to blend them together to get Consistency of fruit, getting the best quality fruit we can, allows to achieve a style of wine that uh, not only we find uh, attractive, but most importantly, that our customers find enjoyable and attractive. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of nicknames for uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. but we call it, yes. we call it vitamin R. Vitamin R. Vitamin R. Did you your vitamin R today? <laughs> Amazing. We just sat for three hours with uh, Richie, the winemaker, and then KR, who's Colonel Rombauer, the owner.